Well, vectors of length 1 are called unit vectors. So we are, we've already seen some standard unit vectors. The vectors that we call standard unit vectors have length 1. These are the vectors with one coordinate equal to 1 and others 0. Well, the unit vectors in R2 are the vectors u with length 1 or u1 squared plus u2 squared equals 1. So u1 squared plus u2 squared equals 1. So look at the following picture. Here we have the unit circle. So it will be an x-axis and a y-axis. So any vector pointing at the circle, if the points are on the unit circle, any such vector is a unit vector in the R2. We have the following theorem. Well, suppose we have an un a vector unequal to zero, an arbitrary vector in the Rn. Then we can find, pretty easy, a vector that has length 1 and has the same direction as V. And this vector is given by U is just the normalized vector which is the vector v divided by its length and this is a unit vector well we can easily see it show it as follows so u the length of u is the length of 1 over the length of v times the vector v and the term 1 over v, we can get it out because it's a constant with an absolute value. It's a property that we've show, shown before. So this equals 1 over the length of v, an absolute value, times the length of v. But we know that the norm of a vector is larger than 0 for non-zero vectors. So we may remove the absolute value sign. So actually we get 1 over the length of v times the length of v equals 1. So again, in the above theorem, u is called the normalization of v. Yeah, it's the vector with equal direction as v, but it has a normalized length, length 1.